Hello, I wrote a poem, like to hear it, here it goes. The creatures within me. I'm being eaten alive by lots of creatures. They constantly move, that's one of their features. Ripping and tearing all of the meat, eating me alive from my head to my feet. I do not know why I am being killed. Hopefully when I'm dead, the hungry mouths will be filled. They point and laugh with sadistic looking faces. There's nowhere to go, I've run out of places. The hypocrites are everywhere, and they all think they're right. But God's not done helping me win this fight. Why am I still alive? I don't know. I'm being toyed with. Um, you don't want to shut down my kidneys and kill me that way because you consider yourselves to be the punishers. And that would be far too nice and easy of a death for me right you want to grow this monster inside of me till it rips me apart from the inside out um that's how todd died because i remember when back when brody was born i put my ear to his stomach i listened and uh, it didn't sound right to me that thing was in there like constantly moving around that's why he bled out into the toilet every day of our relationship he had those things in him or whatever and um either way um i know i'm i'm gonna die and i'm being murdered and um you know there's nothing i can do about it and i don't really care if this world remembers me but you will remember what jesus has done He's done so many things for me, it's not even funny. I really I really don't know why I'm being murdered. I just know that a lot of this, or most of it, has to do with Jerry Martin Smith. And, uh... I don't know what else to say. I wish you'd hurry up. I wish you would kill me put me into a gas chamber lethal injection anything but you can't do that because it's all in secretive but I know everybody is in on it I know everybody at the shelter that I'm in is in on me being murdered and killed I know everybody that I see is in on it it doesn't matter I'll die when I die, I guess. So I'm not going to, um, no, well, at least not at this point. I'm not going to take my own life. Why should I have to? I mean, I got so many people trying to kill me already. Why should I take my own life? That doesn't even make any sense to me. Because I'm in so much pain and misery, maybe. But, um, not yet. I won't do it yet. I can take a lot. I could take a lot more pain and a lot more misery. So keep it coming. I know you will. And by the way, you may not know this or believe it, but you have no right to take my God-given life from me because I have not committed any kind of FBI crimes. And, I, and uh, nothing I have done warrants uh, death. You've already tortured me my whole life with these parasites. Um, I know you're, I know that you're, uh, you're killing a lot of people. You've killed, you, that's what you guys do. You kill people for a living. Um, that's what you do for fun. Punishers. You're not the real punisher. Jesus is the real punisher. And, uh, he knows that I'm not guilty of whatever in the hell it is I'm being murdered for. He knows that my heart, my mind... He knows the cleanliness of my two hands. And where is uh, Jerry Martin Smith and Dwayne Allen Siders, both extremely evil men and both dead way, way before me? How did they die exactly? I do not know. I wasn't there. But I'm pretty sure that you had something to do with it. Pretty sure. And... Uh, death of my husband too I know that you were 
you were working on him you were killing him and all this stuff and uh, I know I know about that why I have a good idea why I know that um, when we were in uh, Florida you had that little FBI uh, girl what would she say she was 16 or something and he like when we were all drinking with everybody her and him went into the bathroom to do sex with each other and that makes him a pedophile <laughs> so um, that's why this must be the reason why you guys were poisoning him to death I guess plus I'm sure that you saw him uh, beat the shit out of my stomach when I was nine months pregnant that's how my water broke by the way when I was nine months pregnant with Michelle punched me in the stomach when I was sleeping anyways um Merry Christmas hmm this is for you FBI Merry Christmas to you and um Brody what can I say I love you son maybe I'll see you around sometime probably not anymore that's okay though I'll see you in the next life I love you with all my heart take care take care of your little sister bye